what's up guys it's dj welcome to the game room today we're back at forza horizon 5 and we're gonna be doing the forza -thon weekly challenge this is one of my favorite things to do of all time and it's always the very first thing that i start with as well and then we've got a new week this week so we've got the ats gt18 and a porsche 911 gt1 as the uh, gifts for this week or <laughs> say gifts i mean the gifts to us we gonna get them Anyway, let's jump in. First thing we need to do, own and drive the smallest production car ever made. The 1962 Bill B-50. And here we are. Wow. Yeah, teeny tiny peely complete. It did say peely. I was going to anyway. Oh, that's great. All right. So what's next? So now we need to smash 100 pinatas in the micro 1962 Bill B-50. Uh, tip, uh, if you can find these in Event Lab. Oh, well, here we go. Uh, this is easy. The uh, Peel Pinata Pop. I love it. <laughs> Let's do it, boys. The Pinata Pop. Pop, pop, pop. Oh, I hope they go like. <laughs> I don't think you can hear that. <laughs> well, I'm gunning it right now. Come on, DJ. Yeah. If I remember correctly, you do need to go kind of slow, but I don't think we're going to have problems with that. Because the pinatas will actually bump into each other, or or maybe that was... Am I really going slow enough to where <laughs> it won't pop them? <laughs> oh, I'm awful. This... <laughs> I'm about 90% sure I missed one. There it is. Just lay it down. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, no. I did get it. E-brake turn. Yeah. Spin them out, boys. All right. I think I think that's all. It said I finished in first. Really? Pilling it complete. All right. What is next? Smash 10 pin. Uh. Uh. What? Turns out I only broke seven. Uh. <laughs> And maybe the other three just kind of fell on the floor. So we got to do this again. I do find it funny that the pinatas are so far away so that it gives you time to accelerate. <laughs> I mean, I had to get an awesome screenshot. Look at this. I'm not saying that I could ride and pedal my bike faster than this, but I could probably get pretty close. All right. The smash hit is now complete. Upgrade your one door, three wheeled. <laughs> is that one door really? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Pill P50 to A class and reach speeds of 110 miles per hour. So, oh, you guys can't see it. My bad. Uh, this should be easy, but I've got an idea. So, I want to go minimum grip. So, we want to put some grip on here. Let's move my big head out of the way. We want to put some grip on here, but I'm not sure exactly how we want to do it. Flip my camera. There we go. So, let's go in here. <laughs> let's, uh, let's see. Uh, ribs and tires, we do want good rims at least. Uh, if we're reaching speed, uh, I think a drag tire? Do we have drag tires? Yes, we do. All right. Drag tire may be what we want. Next thing we want to do is remove a lead bead weight just in case so we can actually get around. So that doesn't need anything. Rear bumper, uh, we could take that off as well. So that's going to be good. There's no weight reduction. Look at this. <laughs> It must be like, there's nothing on the car anyway. It's a Pill P50. Of course there's no weight reduction. What kind of engines do we have? The motorbike engine, of course. Yeah, I mean, we're going to have to install that. We have to put the turbo on here as well. The good thing is we go up to, I think it's A800. So we're, we're, we're going to do okay. Uh, we are not, however, doing the all-wheel drive drivetrain because... Uh, that will do very, very good wonders for us getting up to speed, but I think we've got long straights enough where we don't need to worry about it. In order to help ourselves, we've got to do something with a transmission here. Uh, you can see we get a lot once we start moving up to some higher ratio, especially speed on like a seven speed. That's not bad. Now it does take us up, but I think the seven speed transmission is going to be the way to go. And we want to throw a race clutch on there as well. That way we can get through those gears as quickly as possible. We don't care about any of this because none of this is going to help us reach our top speed. Um, and we just want to max this out as high as we possibly can. And that's it, huh? All right. Well, what else can we do? All right. So I know we can get away with being in like the higher ranks. So 
look at this. This is what I'm talking about. It says that we need to get this uh, in a class A um, and reach the speeds of 110 miles per hour. The thing is, uh, I'm going to be able to reach 110 just fine without being an A class. I mean, we have no more performance upgrades left. I mean, we could throw some transmission on there, uh, maybe. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to see if it'll give me the dub anyway. And it is not. So we're going to have to upgrade this further, which is going to be fine. Totally fine. This is basically going to be maxing this thing out like all the way. So uh, I think the first things first I'm thinking is go into uh, Horizon tires. So it's interesting because the Horizon semi slick tires give me less than the drag tires do. Almost, what is that, 80 less, 60 less? but my grip increases, I don't understand why. But we're going for it, we're gonna go there. I'm going to make the wheels, oh, those are rims, not wheels. My bad, we're not messing with those. Uh, I guess uh, we could go all wheel drive. That puts us almost at the, almost at the bottom of A class. Uh, we come in here, um, let's see. Oh, that's right, we did some weird stuff with the transmission now because we, Gotta do this, all right, well, that's easy to do. We'll go here, we'll go here, we'll go here. And <laughs> we can get a diff finally. Uh, race diff, sure. <laughs> and we'll upgrade these bad boys as well. Uh, just cause, well, we're still, there we go. Finally, we're in A class, God. Whoa, hold on, wait a minute. Hang on. B700 A, okay, Never mind. Never mind. Stop looking at me. We should be able to get up very, very nicely. Now we're gonna be able to get up to 110 miles an hour without any problems. Two wheel drive, one wheel drive, nah fam, three wheel drive. That was the side of another car. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah. Zippity doo dah right out of there. I'm, I'm, I would love to mess with the transmission a little bit and I'm definitely gonna have to. There's no way I can get around it. How high can it go? Can we push this to 170? 135 seems to be the max here. We can bring this down a little bit. I think right around there might be close-ish to 130. Yeah, it is. And then the diff, uh, well, that's not gonna work. We can't send 60% to one wheel. I think if anything, we may, may need to even push it forward a little bit, but that should do us well right here. Oh, we could have hit it too. We could have hit it. All right, down into first. Let's get a nice little zoom zoom. Going from nothing to some, rev it up. Let it go, boys! Through the gears, through the gears, through the gears. This is quick, properly fast. There we go, great competitive. And we are done because for some reason I completed the fourth objective and I have no idea what it was. Ta-da! <laughs> next, we're gonna have a little bit of fun with this guy because if we go into our festival playlist, the next thing we get a point for it is going to be the Mega Evolution. Win a cross-country race in any unlimited off-road vehicle upgraded to S2. So we need to find ourselves a cross-country race. Now, there's a lot of different races that I've got memorized. Uh, this ain't one of them. None of these is one of them. So uh, maybe we'll go over here. That seems fun, maybe, that one, funish. Uh, those are fun. Actually, I think I might have either that one or one of these memorized. You know what? Let's just, born to win. Let's go there. Just went in here to double check this real quick and evidently traction control was on for that peel and it was still screaming, man. Uh, stability's on as well, but we're gonna take that off because this is an off-road race and stability control for my driving style doesn't work very good off-road. We're gonna give this a try and see what we can get into. And hit the gas, baby, go, 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 go. Banging off of the red line, yes, sir. And I did not get a great start. Uh-huh, keep it in fifth, keep it in fifth. Am I okay to keep it? Oh, yeah, got it. Not good. <laughs> Down to the third and across the, not even close to the line. Down, 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 gun it, gun it, gun it. Yes, sir. I did a bad thing. <laughs> I missed it again. Uh, there's there's two things I hate about Forza Horizon. Off-road races and off-road vehicles, man. Neither one. I'm not good at it. 
and I don't enjoy it. I mean, saying that, I'm not doing awful. Barely winning, though. The thing is, even in the uh, difficulty that I normally use for races, which is highly skilled, um, I can do pretty well. I can, I can whoop some butt. But man, something about off-road races, just nah. Especially cross-country events, even worse. You do get to jump, though. Boom. That's always fun. And right here's the line. Oof. We hit. All right. Give me my points. I don't know what that is. Oh. Uh. <laughs> there, there was something going on there with the AI drivers, and I did not want to be a part of it. All right. What do we got? We get points? Got them? Nice. Got it. Sweet. All right. So I think probably for today, that's going to be about it. But in a future video, I am going to be doing uh, this bad boy right here. Can't remember the, the trial. Yeah. We're going to be doing that together. We're also going to be doing the event lab because those are always sometimes fun. Always sometimes. We've got a couple of those this week. Uh, I don't do any of the seasonal playground events. Don't enjoy those. Speed traps. Uh, we'll do that as well. So we'll be doing all these in a future video. So just get subscribed. Why are you not subscribed? Let's do it. Well, guys, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed. Drop a like, get subscribed, and join the new channel. We're having a whole lot of fun over here. Uh, also, check out some of the other videos I've done. Did a lot of Forza. We do have some more videos coming this weekend of uh, Gran Turismo 7, which I'm really, really enjoying, by the way. And I've re-downloaded um, another racing game, Set of Corsa Competition. Maybe we can get in front of the big TV downstairs in the theater room with the steering wheel. See how we do. Otherwise, hope you guys have a great day. We'll see you later. Peace.